Hey, Psych2Goers. Are you having trouble determining if your crush likes you back? Or maybe you're dating someone but aren't quite sure if they genuinely like you. Well, there are a few signs that can help you in determining if they like you, you know, besides asking them. So here are six signs that reveal if they genuinely like you. Number one, they get closer to you than others. Do you notice they get a bit closer to you than your other friends and acquaintances? Are they scooting close into your personal space? If you're comfortable with this and like them too, then it's likely good news. This is a sign someone likes you romantically. Whether they do this intentionally, likely, or suddenly find themselves being drawn closer to you like a magnet, it's a good sign that they're attracted to you. Number two, they lift their eyebrows in reaction to you. Say what? Yep, next time your crush enters a room and sees you, look out for how they react, especially watching those eyebrows. I'm talking about a flash. Eyebrow flash, people. An eyebrow flash is an unconscious social behavior. This is when someone involuntarily lifts their eyebrows due to a sudden release of dopamine. They'll often lift them for a fifth of a second or even a few seconds because they just saw someone they're attracted to or desire. So ask yourself this, do their eyebrows say they're excited to see you? Or are you standing next to a plate of cupcakes? <laughs> cupcakes. Number three, they touch you lightly. Does your crush often touch you lightly or briefly? People wanna get close to the people that they like. And what brings people closer? <laughs> Literally, touching. If someone you are friends with is now throwing their arm around you or running into your arms for a friendly embrace, they may just be getting closer to you as friends, but if an acquaintance is finding a reason to get closer to you, they may be interested in you romantically. Just make sure you're both comfortable around each other. Look out for the warning signs of closed off body language. So if you're at a party and someone in your group keeps subtly or not so subtly putting their hand on your shoulder, innocently bumping into you accidentally or not accidentally, or finding other ways to get closer to you, they likely like you. A tongue twister, say that three times. Likely like you, likely like you, likely like you. Number four, when you talk to them, they give you their full attention. Are they giving you more attention than other casual friends or acquaintances? People can multitask, it's a thing. Although according to psychologists, it's not actually possible or helpful. Multitasking is a pretty stressful thing sometimes. So if your spouse or crush is constantly scanning their social media feed while talking to you or only having time to talk with you during their last match of Halo, they may not be ready to say those three vital words just yet. When we love and genuinely like someone, we are attentive, especially when we need to talk about serious topics. We enjoy focusing on the one we love. We value their opinion and the things they have to say. And first and foremost, we listen and pay attention to your partner, not the scoreboard. Number five, they're displaying open body language. Notice their body language. Are they closed off or is their body language open? Open body language is a fantastic way to tell if someone likes you. This doesn't always mean in a romantic way, but hey, if someone likes you enough to be their friend, they may like you enough to be more than friends, if you know what I'm saying. No, yes, okay, moving on. If someone is sitting in a relaxed open position or perhaps talking openly with their hands, they may subconsciously be showing they like you. Closed off behaviors such as keeping your arms crossed, holding your beverage, phone, or glass in front of your body or keeping your legs crossed and body stiff can all be signs someone just perhaps isn't feeling it today or worse, they ain't feeling you. And number six, they expose their wrists and neck. Does your partner often put their hands out on the table openly or expose their neck more often? People tend to open up to people they like and subconsciously show their weakest spots. Sound kind of creepy, but it's not. Often when we don't like someone, we may become defensive and close ourselves off with our body language. But when we use open body language, we may expose vulnerable parts of our body like our neck or wrists to show we trust someone. We can look to Marilyn Monroe's classic neck tilting pose for inspiration. People may stroke their necks and tilt their heads in interest to show they like you. Showing their hands and not hiding them away in their pockets leaves another vulnerable part of their body, their wrists open for attack. So like, don't be a mountain lion or anything and attack the poor person, but maybe ask them out. So do you think your crush or date genuinely likes you? Do you like them? Well, will you ask them out on a date? Feel free to share your thoughts with us in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the like button and share it with a friend. Subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell icon for more content like this. As always, thanks for watching.